<laughs> so um, I don't know how we, we will uh, manage with uh, Zoom because now my screen is Steven. not to appear. Steven. Steven. Steven is oh, Steven. 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 <laughs> California. Oh. What Hello. Is that nice? Hello, Hello, everybody. Hello. Steven. Ah. Great to see you, Steven. Still, still alive, Steven. Huh? Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Monica, Monica, Lila, I don't know who are these people. So, um, so I think now we, we could start and maybe more people will join, but um, yeah, we, start, yes. we, we have to start. So, um, it's very funny and totally uh, uh, improvised, uh, not improvised, but I don't know exactly how we, we will manage with uh, Zoom and we'll, because um, my idea was to uh, try to, to give more space for everybody so we can share, we can ask questions, etc. instead of doing uh, things very formally. But the thing is that if you want to, uh, to speak, then you have to raise your hand and uh, I will not see everybody, so I don't know. And, and Ingrid, uh, where is Ingrid? I have to change my screen. Ingrid, you are the one who can uh, uh, open or put the microphones on mute. No, just now the host is German, as he will be going to share okay. the screen. Uh -huh. I Okay, 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 okay. He's a host now. Okay, so but we will try even we, we can maybe we can do it without uh, putting the mics on, on mute, but then you have to be uh, everything has to be silent around you because then it's it's very disturbing. So um, I am Bernadette for those uh, who don't know me. Uh, I'm still the president of Eurotas. Uh, for one or two uh, hours, <laughs> years. <laughs> the lovely lapses, but no, 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 no. <laughs> just hours. And uh, as we sent you uh, the, the official report, so I don't know if if it's if there is any interest to to read and to tell what I wrote, uh, except if you if you did not receive it. So, what? Uh, I propose uh, to have more uh, time for you is just to mention some points and to have uh, maybe a discussion or something, well, some exchange, some sharing on these uh, specific points. So uh, as I said in my report, uh, I've been president for seven years. Normally it's six years, but because Ingo, uh, resigned one year before the official year uh, for me, it, it offered me one more year. And now this time it is over. So uh, I, I really, you know, I, I really hope that we could have met in Tallinn this year for the conference uh, that Yuri was starting, uh, trying to organize. And, uh, but of course, as uh, you can understand everything, have been so difficult and and we we i think we we made this decision uh, at the right moment because now from uh, i don't know but from france for instance it's not possible to travel in uh, baltic countries we are not accepted so i think it might be the same for from uh, other countries probably and uh, so that was the only option uh, was to do uh, this uh, general assembly uh, through Zoom, and maybe it gives us uh, the opportunity to have people from, you know, different parts of the world, and that's also very nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So, um, uh, the, the first thing, uh, w w I, I tried to, when I, I wrote this uh, report, I tried to have the, the a general overview of uh, the history of Eurotas. Of course, I was not there at the beginning. The beginning Eurotas started in 1984. 
And um, so there was really different uh, uh, faces, different, uh, uh, yeah, different stories in the long history of Eurotas. And um, the, the, when I, I, I came there, um, I could uh, say that it, there was a, a big um, achievement that we have done, uh, especially with people, two people who are here, uh, Pierre, Pierre, uh, Hans Peter from Austria and uh, Ingo from Germany. And um, the, 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 the reason why we started to work together was because it was the beginning of the certification process that we started to, to, to set. Uh, it was the beginning of uh, 2000, uh, something like that, 2002, I don't remember exactly. And um, this uh, made lots of changes in Eurotas. And later uh, we uh, had to create uh, uh, some departments within Eurotas and the departments uh, the, the first one which was important for this process was ESTP, the Eurotas Society for Transpersonal Psychotherapy. And um, the, the, the certification process uh, then has been organized uh, in this department. And uh, after the certification, uh, then we uh, created an accreditation process for institutes. So now we have... Um, I don't know when it started, maybe in 2009. I don't know exactly, I'm sorry, uh, when it started. But um, now we have, how many? Ingrida, how many <laughs> institute? Eight? Yeah. Please, Ingrida, who knows exactly how many? Uh, it's not good, but I don't know. Institute? Yeah, accredited institute. Where is Ingrida? Right. She, did, she doesn't answer. Ingrida, can you tell us? Microphone. Microphone. So it was in the report, I think it was nine. I don't have the paper, but it's, it's everything in the reporting. No, I don't see it. I don't, I, I don't mention that in the report. Anyway, so I think we have nine uh, uh, transpersonal accredited institutes uh, in Europe and Israel and different countries. And we may have more if uh, some... Uh, people want to, to get this accreditation. And the interest for, for the students is that when they belong and, uh, to an accredited institute, then they get the certification, YOTA certification directly by direct award, instead of doing the uh, longer process of grandparenting. So um, that was a very important, I think, step for Eurotas and it established Eurotas in a more professional way. Um, if you don't agree in Go or on speed up, uh, you, can, you can express the, your disagreement. But I'm sure we worked, uh, it, was, it, it was very, it was very uh, enthusiastic because we really felt that uh, we were giving people a, a new opportunity to create a community. The idea was really to create a community, professional community about transpersonal psychotherapy and uh, in Europe, in Europe. And, uh, and today uh, we have uh, one and 44 uh, professional members. So, it really uh, uh, represents something. Of course, we certified many more uh, practitioners, but some of them, you know, they can't sell, they stop working, they died, uh, you know, because this process started uh, uh, 15, 16 years ago, something like that. So this is one uh, important part of Eurotas. And uh, now they are, there are also other departments which uh, are working on a certification process like uh, the Department of Research, but it, it is really starting. So at the moment, there are only uh, three uh, uh, certifying uh, researcher and uh, probably uh, the Department of Coaching will organize some certification. I don't know, it's up to you. Thank you, to you. Okay, so um, I think we, we uh, need to, um, to continue this, uh, this uh, process because it gives uh, um, 
for people, it gives really a, a sense of community and interest in uh, building something together. And of course, uh, what is important is the possibility that we meet once a year during our conferences, which is not possible this year, but this is a very, very, very special time year. <coughs> um, so what else should I say? <coughs> I think there is uh, also something, I, I, I will not talk about everything because you have read the, the report, but I would like to, to talk about the, the Youth Council. And this is also a, an opportunity to, to give some uh, uh, honor, tribute to Dennis Jensen, who has to resign from the board because of health uh, issues. And you, uh, Dennis uh, really uh, uh, took this project and, and, uh, and uh, to connect with younger people, um, you know, it, it like a, a new energy because we were in the world, you know, we were uh, more experienced. And uh, <clears throat> so uh, as Dennis, uh, is not able to get some noise. I, I think that you have to mute, you, mute your microphone. If you or you know. mute the microphone or you stop the, the, the noise around you. It is Mario Lorenzetti who can the noise. Mario. Okay. Uh, and and uh, uh, we, yeah, because I said that in the book we are more or less a singer. And uh, please. Sorry, it's hard to, to, to hear you. Maybe who, you who is a host? Host can mute everyone. Yes, host, please. Yes, better. Mute everyone. Shall, shall yeah. Yes, yes. But don't mute me. Okay. For the moment, for the moment. Yeah. In the right side, where is the chat? You can see mute everyone. Yes, in the right side. Is the chat mute everyone? Yeah. Yeah. On bottom. Bottom. Okay. Here. Okay. Okay. I think it's okay. Um. Okay, Shama. No, it's okay. Okay. It's okay. Okay. Yes. And uh, what what we 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 expect is that these uh, uh, youngers will uh, have more and more uh, power and influence on the future of Eurotas, of course. And uh, now we have Marc Antoine with us, who is. Uh, originally from this uh, uh, Youth Council. Marc-Antoine is a, a citizen of the world, but uh, <laughs> is in Lebanon at the moment, which is a, um, a place where there happen so many difficult events. So, okay. Yeah, actually, I'm not in Lebanon right now. Ah, where are you, Marc-Antoine? I'm in France. I'm in Burgundy, ah. in France. Oh, you are in France. Okay. Yeah, I arrived a week ago. Okay, okay. Oh, I yeah. didn't. Okay. Um, okay, and and we welcome uh, Lita. Where is Lita? She's somewhere on my screen. Lita, raise your hand that everybody can see you. Uh, Lita from from uh, Latvia. Um, we will uh, replay somehow Dennis and Lita was also a <clears throat> member of the Youth Council. So. Uh, Marc Antoine, Lita, you are you are part of the. You will maybe design also the future of Eurotas, and uh, but you know this will be a, a, another step, and <clears throat> it will be introduced by by the new uh, <clears throat> the new team from from for the presidency. So what else should I say? So I don't know. Um, what uh, uh, what I, I can also share with you is um, 
something more personal about uh, Eurotas and my work there and how at the board we, we worked uh, there for uh, these past years. Um, <clears throat> actually, for me, it was really a, a, an honor to be, to be able to work for the transpersonal community. You know, I was already transpersonal psychotherapist and one of my uh, professional interest was to uh, work to give uh, transpersonal psychology and psychotherapy uh, a, a place uh, uh, in, in my country, France, but also in Europe or internationally because uh, at the moment, you know, uh, it's not uh, well considered enough and we, are, we really have to work to uh, uh, open uh, people to these uh, uh, values and vision. Because in my opinion, uh, if we don't um, include the transpersonal uh, uh, values, you know, in, in each one of us and in our communities and, and societies, then we we maybe not have a really a future. Um, if we don't become, when I say transpersonal, of course it means many things, but I, I'm not sure we will have a future actually if we if we don't really give space to our spiritual dimension and integrate spirituality, you know, in uh, our uh, actions, in our daily lives, in our decisions at every level, you know. Would be it would be so wonderful if we could uh, I don't know if it might happen but if we could have uh, as members some politicians uh, you know who really would like to to introduce transpersonal visions in their their uh, uh, field of action but this is one of my dream I have many dreams but who knows maybe it will happen you know. They did not, some of them, it happened very, very rarely, but they don't belong to Eurotas or any transpersonal association, which is not the problem, but it, it, would, it would be really interesting. And this is why also, you know, as, a, um, as an international association, uh, we, we wanted to um, also uh, um, act at the level of the society and this is uh, why we uh, decided uh, I think it was two years ago to um, apply to become uh, we, we had the, 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 the idea that we should become an, an NGO but as a first step <clears throat> we thought it would be easier to first um, uh, become UNESCO member and we applied two years ago to become UNESCO member. And at that time, uh, we have not been very successful, but it was the first attempt. And, you know, in this kind of process, you very often have to, to, to do it several times because you don't know exactly how to, to make it and to answer the, all the, the questions. So um, we don't want to give up but uh, we have to do it in a different way and maybe more, I don't know, professionally or, or knowing better exactly what they want or what we should uh, emphasize. I don't know exactly. But I, we thought it would be important that uh, th there is at the level of NGOs, uh, um, associations like Eurotas uh, to, to, to be part of the transformation we, we want to serve. Um, I would say also that uh, being president of uh, such a beautiful uh, big community and, uh, and uh, board, we are 11 members <clears throat> in the board, uh, has also been a, a real pleasure and uh, really uh, uh, an experience of uh, brotherhood uh, and um, I never I never felt disappointed I never felt disappointed sometimes we things were not easy sometimes we we had 
uh, disagreements or even conflicts, but you know, we never, um, I mean, there, it, it was just the way a human being, you know, uh, used to, to, to work and to share. And uh, I'm very happy that we have always been able to uh, overcome, you know, these, uh, let's say, more or, or less difficult steps and especially in the process of uh, designing the, the, the new phase of Eurotas. Um, because when, uh, when I, I became a, a president, it was, the situation was different. And um, uh, there was no other candidates. And uh, uh, I was uh, vice president working with, uh, close, uh, closely with Ingo. And, um, at the beginning, I, I said, I will never, never be president of this association. And <laughs> no, no, not at all. And then I just said yes, because it was like uh, something very natural after Ingo working closely with him. So I was the, the legitimate candidate. I don't know how to say that. And uh, so, I, I want to thank you, all my friends, because you have been uh, very, really supporting me, and uh, and uh, I always uh, felt that your, your presence and your different uh, um, uh, visions, understanding, and uh, and uh, so we all bring something to 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 the association, and um, then. At this time, I, 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 where it's the end of my, my presidency, um, I decided that I, it was not for me time to leave the board and that I would uh, stay there in order to keep a sort of continuity and now supporting uh, the new team which will be in charge. Um, so, yeah, a big thank you. It's uh, also I'm moved, you know, today to to say it's goodbye, but not goodbye because I will stay there. So you will have to then to 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 see me, to work with me, as I will see you and work with you also. So a deep, deep thank you to all my friends from the board. <laughs> and um, so uh, what we could do now is, uh, uh, as you have read this uh, report and uh, you, because some of you, you know very well Eurotas for quite a long time, some others you are very new. So uh, if you want now we can share a little bit or if you have questions, I can answer or other people can answer. And then the next step, I, I will uh, give the microphone to the different board members so that they can uh, 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 speak a little bit more about their, their uh, uh, department, the department they are in charge of or, or their actions uh, over the last year, et cetera. So is there any questions, comment? So you can raise your hand, but um, maybe Sharma, you should put the microphone so that people can talk, but I don't see everybody at once. Who would like to say? When you speak, please uh, tell your name so that we can find who is talking. Katy wants to say. Yeah. Katy, where is Katy? Yeah. Okay, Katy. Thank you very much, Bernadette, for your work. Thank you, Katie. Thank you. <laughs> this is Stephen Schmitz from California, USA. Yes, and <clears throat> Bernadette, as representative of ATP and as uh, seeing you as an esteemed colleague, I want to share a very deep appreciation of all the great work you've done to further both Eurotas and the transpersonal community. All your efforts are 
have been very excellent and uh, much appreciated, as I said. And I want to thank you from ATP for all your efforts. Um, I have really enjoyed the working relationship that we have with our two associations. And I just want to say that you will find, as I have and as Ingo has expressed to me, there is life after presidency, and I wish you very well. <laughs> thank, you. thank you, thank you, Stephen. Yeah, yeah, from an ex-president to another ex-president. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes, there so, is a I, I would like to say something. Who? Hans Peter from Hans Austria. 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 Yeah. From Austria. I, I have not been in any Eurotrust meeting since a long time and I'm very happy to to see many of you again <laughs> and uh, I remember when you became president of Eurotrust and I remember also the the great times we had together developing all these things you mentioned before and um, yeah, I, I wanted to come to the conference this year, but unfortunately it could not take place, but maybe next year. <laughs> but uh, I'm, I'm very happy to, to be part of this meeting today and also to say thank you to you and um, all you did all over the, those years. And uh, yeah, I, I would like to rejoin more to Eurotas again and uh, thank you for everything and uh, I have very very nice and good memories yeah, <laughs> yeah okay and I wanted to say something um, I'm responsible for the registration in Austria and uh, I think with Ingrida I will speak at the end what I need from the board members to register everything here in Austria yeah and I just wanted to announce that I prepared all the papers and uh, <laughs> I will do this afterwards. Okay, thank you. Yeah, okay, thank you. So you are still very uh, committed and useful uh, for the association. Yes, 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 yes. In a silent way, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but very, very important. Yeah. So, which yes. means we are legal. legal. Yes, yes, yes. We are legal. Yes, okay. <laughs> okay, someone else? Ingo, you want to speak? You can you can unmute yourself. On the low left, you can mm -hmm. unmute. I think he knows. Okay. Now it's now it's working now. Yeah. Yes. yes. Uh, okay. Uh, so Bernadette, so also some words <laughs> from my side. You know, I, what I really admire. Uh, when I when I when I'm with you, you are some kind of mixture between very strong. You're sometimes you're in the middle of a storm and you are very quiet, <laughs> and and you are standing there very friendly, very related to others, and at the same time you are very sensitive, mm -hmm. you know, and very open to the spiritual. Uh, you're a woman who's very uh, who is realizing in the authentic spiritual. And I think this is very important uh, when you're doing trans, uh, when you're working as a spiritual teacher, a transpersonal psychotherapist, and when uh, we are bringing uh, this, the transpersonal and the spiritual into this world. And, um, you know, and I also thank you for our friendship and we have a long, long friendship and, and it will not end after, after you. Sure. And I must say, I'm very, very moved to see you all. It's, it's wonderful to see you all. Normally, I didn't have time today, but I really wanted to do it. So uh, thank you to see you all. It's very moving for me. Yeah, and what we can, Ingo, thank you very much. What we can say to, to the new people is that through Eurotas, you can get so many friends internationally. So that's, that's also yeah, something very personal and, and touching. Okay. Bernadette, I also want to say something to 
express Good my plan. admiration. Yeah. Say your name. Say, uh, so. Ludmila Sportesco from Republic of Moldova. Mm -hmm. I'm a board member. And I just want to express my admiration to you because before I'm in the Eurotas from 2003. Um, and for before you, I uh, saw five presidents. And um, this uh, female feminism, femininity, this is how you um, express yourself like a president. For me, it was uh, really like uh, something uh, new in the Eurotas. And um, uh, I want you to say to, uh, thank you very much. You decide to, to stay after the presidency in Eurotas to be in the board because before uh, all the presidents left the board um, and uh, they just uh, become a president and then they left. But um, thank you, you decided to stay with us and uh, to give more experience of uh, experience to uh, all your experience uh, to give more and to work with us. Thank you very much. Thank you for accepting me. <laughs> mm -hmm. okay. Maybe some uh, questions about uh, the, the, our realizations in Eurotas, what, what I said or was what, what was written in the report and maybe it's not that clear for some of you. <clears throat> I, I wanted to ask you, I wanted to ask you, what is the application for the UNESCO? What is the application of, uh, for, for UNESCO? I think this, this is very interesting for me. Uh, but UNESCO is, uh, you, you know what is UNESCO, and what we wanted is to become a member. What, what, what the, there were different kind of members, so it was the first, uh, I would say, uh, first level, first step, uh, because on the cultural aspects, and we try to really show how transpersonal was also connected to uh, um, uh, indigenous wisdom and making a, a, a connection with ancient traditions and, and modernity. We, this is what we try to, to, but maybe, you know, we did not do it uh, the right way. I don't know. And uh, so what we decided, but it will not, I, I should not talk more about that because it will uh, not be my, I, I mean, I it will be collectively our, our task, uh, is that we, maybe we need to be helped because, you know, it, it requires some, uh, we are not professional uh, in, in uh, how to, to, to make this kind of applications. And maybe we, it, we were too, I don't know, too simple to, I don't know exactly. But we, we, we this is something because we, we got the answer, uh, when was it, but quite recently. So we, we did not, um, we, we have not had time, you know, to, to, to talk more about that and, and see exactly what we, how we have to, to do the next step. But it will be important because it's easy, it's much easier to, to belong to UNESCO and uh, uh, at first. Then, then your rotors could become an NGO. I don't know, we, we, we will not say NGO as a UNESCO members. NGO will be a next step with United Nations depending, you know, connected to, United, connected to United Nations. So if anybody has competencies <laughs> in that kind of uh, uh, application, uh, we, we would be very happy, you know, to, to get some help. I have a question. Um, was who, is there, talking, who is talking? Hans Peter. Hans Peter, okay. Was there any progress in... Um, uh, in um, in, in the EAP approach, <laughs> yeah. or is it is this um, <coughs> over? EAP 
is a long process, as you know, uh, Hans Peter. I don't remember exactly when we started the first application, but I think it was something like 12 years ago, I would say. Huh? Yes, yes. And uh, so the last, I, I, I think we applied three times. Mm -hmm. And the last time was in 2018. So EAP for people who are not European is the European uh, Association for Psychotherapy, which uh, uh, unites in, a, in, a, in a, all, all the, the different uh, modalities. You know, it's not transpersonal, specifically transpersonal. And for the moment, they are a little bit uh, afraid of having uh, transpersonal uh, uh, representatives. And um, so the last refusal uh, happened in 2018. And of course, each time we have official reasons, different official reasons, but the truth is that they are afraid. And, uh, and you know, uh, the last time uh, on Peter, this happened when there was this, uh, in Austria, in your country, there was a, 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 a I don't know, you know better than me, a, a huge problem uh, between, uh, uh, yeah. how would you explain that? Between the, the Ministry of Health and our association, yeah, yeah, we had, um, in fact, we lost the accreditation uh, to do a, a further training in 2014, yeah, mm -hmm. and it could not be resolved until now. Ah, it's not resolved. No, 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 not yet. Yeah, yeah. The accreditation because they were afraid there was a, some, some people from EAP uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, pretending that uh, there was a, a, a it, it was like esoterism, mm -hmm. yes. and, uh, sectarian things, etc. So, uh, Austria. It's Peter, Peter Schultes from Switzerland. He yeah. he was in behind of all those things. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And and it was very active, you know, in the process of refusing us. Yes. So, <laughs> but <laughs> so in uh, the last refusal was in 2018, mm -hmm. but um, and we decided to take a break. So mm -hmm. we we didn't do anything since then, and uh, we will see how to to. But we, we, we have the idea to, to, to try again, to apply again, but maybe later, maybe. Because also, my, you know, my, my feeling is that uh, within EAP, things will also evolve because more and more practitioners, they uh, include not, not maybe transpersonal uh, uh, methods, but they are open to transpersonal methods or they practice, for instance, uh, some of the monotropic breath work, mm -hmm. or they, they include spirituality in, in their framework, etc. Mm -hmm. So it, I think it will change, but I don't know exactly when, so we'll see. So Next, but I, next generation. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, maybe uh, sooner, but uh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we have to add that uh, we uh, gave up also because uh, to be part of EAP you need to be a psychotherapy association and we have not only psychotherapists inside so we should split the Eurotas in two to apply to be accepted. Yeah, that's right. So this was another obstacle that let us thinking about. Yeah. yeah but you know Pierluigi what is funny is that this is something they said at the last uh, uh, application. They never told us before because it would have been very simple and they could have said, oh, we are sorry, you are not an association of psychotherapists, only psychotherapists, so you cannot become a member. And then, you know, it would have been clear, but they never said that before. So this is why, I'm, you know, I'm not sure this is the main reason because the people who supported us within uh, 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 EAP, um, they, they were never, never so clear about that. So that, you know, everything is, you never know exactly what is the truth. Um, may, I, may I bring in the idea, to, if, you, if you think about and if you discuss about a new application to EAP, maybe uh, that you are discussing if this is really worthwhile. You know, it's, it's very time and power and energy consuming. And 
uh, how would it be, how would it be if Eurotas focuses on uh, its own strength and its own qualities? And, uh, and I think, I think Eurotas could grow so nicely and is so competent and uh, could care more for its own competencies. And I don't think that Eurotas needs EAP. You know, I read, I read now uh, the, 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 uh, the, the letter uh, Peter Schulte, uh, Schultes uh, wrote, he published it in the internet, the rejection of Eurotas. And oh. I have been reading it. And, you know, it was the old thing and it is more, that was very ideological and it was very narrow. So, uh, so uh, I think Eurotas as a transpersonal association has a bigger a context, a bigger frame, and uh, and a broader and a more extended understanding, and a more uh, extended worldview. And I, I think I think EAP is very traditional. Mm, it is. Uh, oh, it's already. So maybe 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 it could be a, an idea to give it up for the sake of Eurotas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe. Good good insight. Thank you. I agree. Okay, so oh, Bernadette, I have a. I don't know if this is a good place Ethan, for you to Ethan, talk about it. Just joking. Tell um, your name. Yeah, excuse me. My name is Stephen Schmitz. Um, on one of the documents you sent out to us, there's a mention of a special new membership developed, something about honoring shamans and contributions to transpersonal as yoga, Tao, Zen masters. I obviously am interested in that. Oh, can you speak a little bit to that? So that, I, I will not answer because now, you know, it, it, you give me a transition. Thank you to, to give uh, the, the microphone, if I can say, to uh, other members if they want to speak a little bit about uh, uh -huh. their realization, their department, etc. So please, um, that, Magda, maybe you can uh, answer uh, Yes. <laughs> this is for the next, the next uh, proposal, for the next uh, step. We will explain after to you. Ah, okay. Thank you. Okay. So, ah. yeah, but Magda, you can, you can yeah. talk about the. Yes. Thank you, thank you, Stephen. Uh -huh. Thank you. Yes, yes, because that that, that is a, is an initiative that came from the the, the creation of Eureka or, or the ancient uh, department of of uh, EDICA, no? where we want, we, we want to invite you, you are member also, uh, Stephen and some of you uh, of this department uh, in order to honor shamans, honor masters and honor all these kind of people who have not an academic uh, uh, title, but who are, have been teaching to the transpersonal so much. Then, I think we have to honor, you have to recognize, you have to give to them all this kind of, 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 of visibility in our association because we have been learning so much from them and that is very important. We, we, we need, really need to, to meet together and to create the way for to do that uh, uh, a fact. That is the idea. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Stephen. Yeah. Okay, so um, now other board members who are in charge of uh, a department, maybe if you want, if you want to say some words about your activities to to introduce the department, so that the, the members uh, know a little bit more about uh, what you have done, what we have done. I don't know. Okay, I'll go next. Yuri. Yeah. Yuri. Okay. Uh, main activity is I'm in charge of the Department of Education. I was supposed tomorrow to be in Stockholm to do uh, some public event about what is transverse education. But I was informed that when I come back, I need to go two weeks to quarantine, which I cannot afford it because of my work. So it was postponed. But uh, I'm actually now uh, 
in contact with people from India, uh, Hong Kong, and South Africa regarding uh, some kind of progress of establish some kind of uh, programs of transpersonal education. There are already diff different uh, small groups that are actually doing it, but those groups want to connect with Eurotas and start to work more in depth according to the transpersonal views and guidelines. Uh, so I, at the moment, have an institute with 120 students in Estonia. Uh, in Romania, we have 50 students. Uh, I'm co cooperating with the Latvian Institute and with uh, Ludmila in Moldova. Uh, just this project of education is expanding. The, the other thing that I'm concerned about, uh, I'm really busy about, is uh, what I, I see myself as the ambassador of Eurotas actually to try to establish more transpersonal association and transpersonal activities in other countries or help transpersonal uh, association in other countries uh, to actually to become more active. Uh, so yesterday I was in touch with uh, Orin Baev from Bulgaria and we already established contact and the moment this corona thing will start to ease off, uh, I'll be going to Bulgaria to help them. And anybody that needs help with the association, any promotion, public talks, or any kind of ideas, I am available. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I can speak now for EDTR. Yeah. It's Regina founding member, co-founding member Lindy is present. That's really great. Thank you, Lindy. Um, so EDTR was founded several years ago. Co-founding members were Lindy. Hey, EDTR. Can you say what is EDTR? So it's Eurotas Research Department. It was founded several years ago, 2015, 2016. And co-founding members were Lindy, myself, Joanna and Rona. And um, in the, this latest um, board meeting in uh, January in Sicily, we decided to expand the vision of research also to include publication, which is primarily initiated with Perluiti through the uh, Integral Transpersonal Journal. And uh, kind of like a collaboration we developed was the Transpersonal Research Colloquium. It happened the first time in Italy, in Milan, after Feeding the Soul 2016, the first Transpersonal Research Colloquium. Since then we had it annually and now biannually. And uh, really what, what we could see is like really more, more publications coming through ITG and other, other transpersonal journals. And at the moment, we are at a point that we would like to kind of send out a call formally again to, to ask for, for new interested members. And uh, we really are, we are really looking to uh, initiate new projects uh, with um, transpersonal scholars who are interested in research and have a, who have an academic and research background. And I myself also am in, in, uh, involved in teaching in a, I left trust in UK with Les Lancaster and also Ubiquiti University with Perluigi established at an integral transpersonal institute in Italy at a master and PhD level. And I really feel my calling uh, means I'm a practitioner for long term, but I'm always interested in preaching the practice to the research and practice the uh, preaching the practice to publication also. And through my teaching on the one hand and through the activities in EDTR, I feel really this is kind of part of my calling that I would like to contribute. And um, I kind of feel we have a new chapter now, a new president and um, new people coming in. And uh, I feel it's just refreshing uh, a vision, which, which was always there, but we really need hands on help and we need really hands on people who really would really contribute actively to initiate more projects. So that's kind of maybe a call that we can send out later on. 
and um, the Transpersonal Research Colloquium was last time in Paris after the conference, which was really uh, one of the most precious so far, which I felt and Per Luigi also, we were co-leading that. It was a smaller group, but very engaged um, people, researchers from all over the world. And uh, so next year would be the next TRC. And um, given the COVID situation, of course, we don't know yet. Yeah, There were volunteers who would like to host the TRC, but uh, we don't know yet what will be possible. And maybe even an online version could be uh, interesting to just make it really easy to bring a bigger group of researchers together. Uh, but we have not decided yet. And we will announce that later on in the year. And uh, yeah, so I really would like to send out a, a warm welcome and a warm welcome if you are interested or if you know colleagues or scholars who could be interested, please uh, shoot an email to me. I will be very happy to engage further. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ingrida. Thank you. Uh, Regina, sorry, excuse me. So who's next? Who would like to I say something? I connect to Regina shortly. To Say your name. Pierluigi Latuada. Uh, I am the editor of the Integral Transpersonal Journal, and uh, we are connected uh, with the Department of Research that I supported since the beginning, and uh, we organized the four uh, research colloquium. And uh, <coughs> I think that uh, having a uh, a journal, having a place where uh, all our experience can uh, go and can be grounded into words is also very important because it's something that stay, you know, our process of life develop, transform and goes and writing stays. So I think it's very important also to recognize the importance of the the journal, and this is the reason why I am engaging with the Integral Transpersonal Journal, and I hope we, more and more, we will have the opportunity to write our experience there and do research on it. Thank you. Well, Lindy McMullen, I just wanted to say thank you, Regina um, and Pierluigi. Yes, being part, I, I know that I've been away for quite some time. And I just wanted to basically say that I am working with students at PhD and master level at three universities here in Athens. And I lecture and I have brought the transpersonal into even CBT, which is quite interesting for me at a distance to see that they're working, therapists are working with themselves and teaching um, qualitative research. I am on the verge of bringing in Rosemary Anderson's intuitive inquiry into the module because of course I create my own modules. I'm head of the department, so I can to a large extent decide what is done, etc. So Regina, it will be nice that we can get back together and get a new influx and see what can be done with students. Actually, I'm now overseeing one who is doing work on nature and it was great for me to introduce her to the transpersonal eco psychology section and get her excited about that. So it really is an interesting change and shift where we are seeping into mainstream in a very beautiful way. So I just wanted to share that and we'll be in touch. And thank you, Bernadette. I just want to add there. I remember when I did the conference in Greece, you and Ingo, it was at that time that Ingo was finishing and you came. So I'm quite moved with having spent this time with you. Thank you. And thank you uh, also, Lindy, because uh, you are doing also a great job within Eurotas. Uh, you are not aware, you are the editor of the, the newsletter and uh, in a very, very uh, efficient and nice way. So thank you for that too. Thank you, really. Okay, so any, anyone, anyone else? Ingrida? Ingrida, Ingrida. Hi, Ingrid. I'm Ingrida Indane from Riga. And I'm the board member and also the 
executive director of Euratas, and I also am a member of VSTP of the Certification and Accreditation Committee. Uh, yeah, first of all, I would like uh, to thank Bernadette for the wonderful cooperation all these seven years. We worked together and it was well, it was very, very nice feel feeling to work with you. And I hope uh, it will continue during the next years with the board as well. And also, uh, I want to uh, thank Lindy for cooperation with designing the, making the newsletter. So she, she always does everything so fast and answers so correctly. And it's re really a great pleasure to work with you, Lindy. Uh, so, Thank you very much, Ingrida. You make me a little weepy, but thank you very much. <laughs> no, I love working with you as well. <laughs> uh, yeah, so, so uh, for Euratas, I'm the person who answers uh, your uh, emails and applications uh, first. And... Uh, mm, I receive the emails, the correspondence, and then if you have any questions or interests, you always can connect me by email. And I also help the new professional members sometimes to write their, to, to, to continue to finish their applications if they have some, uh, if they don't understand maybe some questions or uh, as they are not English speaking and, and, and about some documents, I always try to do my best to help. And uh, yeah. And for myself, I'm also in Latvia, I'm the director and founder of uh, Transpersonal Education Institute. And uh, it is also Eurotas accredited institute. And uh, we have uh, about 35 wonderful students here now. <clears throat> and already the, fast, the first graduates. And so, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm totally in the transpersonal field and I don't want to get out of it because I feel wonderful with all of you, with all this, these board members and uh, all my work. So, okay, that's from me, thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Ingrida. Yes, you are a, a, a key person in your hotels, obviously. Obviously, you make things easier for all of us. Um, I think it would be nice that the other board members uh, speak a little bit. Shalma, you will speak later because this will be the finance uh, short report. But then maybe Vladimir, uh, maybe Marc-Antoine. Yes. Is it only for... Marc-Antoine? I can okay. speak. Ah, who? Yeah, Vladimir. Vladimir from Russia. My name is Vladimir Maikov. I'm from Moscow, Russia. Uh, so I'm in uh, Eurotas for 25 years, uh, since 1996. So uh, I feel uh, the people of Eurotas. Uh, and so um, it's uh, great uh, to be a member of this uh, transpersonal family, which is transforming into global uh, transpersonal network now. So uh, I'm um, representing Russia, Russian Association. I'm chair uh, of transpersonal psychology at Moscow Institute of Psychoanalysis. Uh, this is the biggest uh, uh, Russian uh, institute in the field of psychology and uh, psychotherapy. And it's one of nine accredited institute of Eurotas. So I, I'm supervising uh, uh, the teaching um, process of transpersonal psychotherapist in Russia. And each year uh, uh, we have uh, several people who, uh, are, uh, who uh, completed uh, this uh, uh, very important program. 
so uh, uh, I'm also publisher. Uh, I, uh, I already published uh, over 100 books in transpersonal psychology, all books by Stan Grof and uh, Arne Mindel and many other, other great um, uh, transpersonal uh, pioneers. And also, uh, I'm film maker in Eurotas. I'm uh, uh, I'm not a chair of any department, but I am belonging uh, to uh, um, uh, different uh, uh, activities and uh, uh, also member of uh, Eurotas department of indigenous knowledge and anthropology. Uh, so uh, it's a great uh, privilege uh, to be a member of such great family and to serve. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Marc-Antoine, who is uh, one of our young... Uh, <laughs> members. Hello, Marc-Antoine. Um, I'm not really sure if we should, uh, if I should elaborate on uh, what I've been doing in the past or for the future. Uh, what is present, but what you're doing right now in Europe, I don't know. So well, yeah, what I'm doing right, so I'm going to do my best. So uh, basically, um, since I joined Eurotas last uh, year in February, it was not, uh, yeah, I mean, considering the fact that I'm young and I'm not a, a active uh, risk, like, you know, I have not so many years of experience behind me to justify anything. Uh, and my contribution to Eurotas uh, has been to basically uh, connect, I would, I mean, to connect somehow and I'm working on, um, I mean, maybe it would be a good opportunity to speak about it now, but uh, we're creating a new website for Eurotas. And uh, so I'm um, basically taking in charge the new website of Eurotas, uh, which has also a position um, yeah it will change basically the positioning of Eurotas as an association around the world and it would be like the idea was instead of just staying at the Eurotas European Transpersonal Association to become the Eurotas Global Transpersonal Network and so to create a platform through a website which would be basically um, a go-to place to anyone uh, keen on being connected to the transpersonal anywhere in the world. And so it would be basically like just, uh, um, well, yeah, so we're working on a website. I don't know if I uh, will have more time later to discuss this or I should just throw everything now. Later, later, later. So yeah, I'm basically like the young guy who's doing the technical stuff on uh, of your desk, but also with a business perspective, which is also part of my uh, experience, which is not to be like commercial, but to how to uh, utilize um, tools from the world of business to basically um, be more impactful <clears throat> as a transpersonal association worldwide. And so I'm, we're yeah, collaborating on, on that, I would say, and uh, also with the Youth Council, but I haven't been as active as uh, Dennis and he is unfortunately not with us and like he, he's not on the board anymore and also this is something uh, we will maybe discuss later on. So yeah, there's uh, basically what I have to say for now. Thank you. I'm very happy to be with all of you here and yeah. Thank you, Marc-Antoine. So I think it would be nice to hear some words from uh, Lita, our new young board member. She, she is completely new. This is her uh, first uh, uh, participation in the uh, Eurotas event uh, officially as a board member. So Lita, could you say something? Yes, I can. Hello, everybody. I am Lita and I'm from Latvia. Ah. Uh, well, my uh, trip and transpersonal started in year 2016 when I started my personal psychotherapy and then I started to go to school uh, where Ingrida is a director and uh, she invited me to come to Romania to my first year at this conference. <laughs> well, 
and that's it. I was hooked up. I understood that this is uh, the field which I really enjoy, where I can learn a lot. And um, yeah, till now I'm learning. And now I'm also uh, sharing the things which I have learned to other people, like consulting people in their troubles in life. And um, I'm happy that uh, I can be a part of this family. And uh, I know that this will be a great journey together with all of you. Because you will be in charge of the Youth Council now, Alita. Yeah. And uh, well, I'm young. <laughs> you need to be young. Yeah, of course. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do that. I will think about it and then I will inform you. We can you. also collaborate together. Yeah, we can definitely. <laughs> yeah. And um, yeah, I'm happy that I'm here. And uh, thank you. To you all. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so I, I think I didn't. Uh, and I, think I will say something also. Uh, Ludmila Skorcesko from Republic of Moldova. Ludmila, okay. okay. Uh, in my country, I have a transpersonal development uh, organization, and we have been uh, conducted many trainings, course seminars, and summer schools in collaboration with different institutes and organizations for 17 years. Most of these organizations are member of Europass. Thanks to all my colleagues for their contribution to the development of transpersonal in my country. This is what I want to say. And about my contribution to Eurotas, I'm a member of uh, Eurotas Committee of Certification and Accreditation. And also I'm the coordinator of Ethics Committee. And I'm also happy we don't have uh, any problem with the Ethics Committee. That's why I don't have too much work in the coordinating something to here. And currently I'm in a working uh, group with uh, Mark Anthony to work on the new website for you with us. This is, and I'm very happy to work with you for so many years. You are my family, spiritual family, and I'm very proud to be this, the part of this family. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, Ludmila. So I think I, that I would like to say just two words about the coaching department. Mm -hmm. Yes, Shana, uh, it was just, I wanted to invite you to talk. Yes, yes. After a few years of uh, preparing and uh, fighting, uh, uh, so the, we have right now in Eurotas mm -hmm. coaching department. <laughs> you know what is coaching, eh? <laughs> coaching <laughs> department. <laughs> <laughs> so. And I would like to dedicate, dedicate that coaching department to John Rowan, mm -hmm. who helped me mm -hmm. a lot and passed away two mm -hmm. years ago. It was a very, very good therapist, psychologist, and has been several times in Barcelona. So that department uh, it will be a very strong one. Mm -hmm. Gibbon helped me very much. Mm -hmm. And also in, uh, in Switzerland, Ralph Wills also encouraged me very much. So coaching and transpersonal, it's a good uh, platform to solve our problems in our life, in our daily life. So that's all. Welcome. Okay, <laughs> okay. so Sharma, maybe you could uh, uh, continue by, because this has to be done today, um, to introduce, to, to, to say some words about uh, the financial report. I'm not sure that will interest people so much, but it has to be done. So if you could share the screen, see and... Yes. and, and yes. You know, Eurotas is not a rich association. We, we do a lot without mm -hmm. not so much money because we do everything for free. We pay our travel expenses, you know, when we meet together, etc. But anyway, we have a little bit of, uh, of money we try to, to use for a new project, for a new website, for instance. So, Shalma, if you can... Uh, 
Yes, I am the treasurer of that association and we have in our bank in Austria, in, in mountains in Austria, we have our a little, a little money for to, uh, for to do activities. So let's, I will try to share with you in the screen. Mm -hmm. So could you see our numbers here? Yes. Okay, then I will, I will select here. Okay. You will see at uh, our real budget and uh, can, can, can you show a little bit more because we, we so that we can see all the incomes we don't have all the lines from the incomes you have two more lines total revenue. The, the incomes eh, you mean okay yeah, we don't see everything voilà. okay. incomes and okay. expenses eh? yeah. the total incomes so, the total, total incomes eh? okay. so you have here the real budget of the two previous years the 2018-2019 and 2019 till 2020. Fiscal year is from July last year till July uh, that year, the current year. We have incomes organizations, real budget of, of uh, that year, fiscal year, 3,500 euros, Accredited institutes 2,495, individual members 1,603, uh, professional members 9,000 euros, certifications 1,900, accreditations 200, donations, we have sometimes donations and that donations maybe Bernadette can explain for, from they come from. Yeah, it, for, from the last conference. From the last conference in Paris? Yes. Then we have, we, we also help, uh, we help uh, associations and people who organize conference, like uh, this year it was to be, has to be in, uh, in Tallinn, and this is 3,000 euros that for helping next conference next year. So, Total revenue in that uh, current year, last year, 22,700 euros. And then expensives, we have uh, executive, our executive director, Ingrida, our webmaster. We will, have, uh, we will have a new webmaster next year. And then uh, domain hosting, office supplies, uh, board meeting lunch. That means sometimes when we are doing board meeting, we need to pay for to have a space to meet together. That was when we were uh, last uh, uh, last year in Crete. Bueno, in, uh, no in Crete, in the Sicilia. other in the other Sicilia. Sicilia. Yeah. Sicilia. yeah. So ETG uh, subscription is uh, Pierluigi Italian uh, um, journal, very important, and so uh, that is uh, uh, for the new website you see uh, 650 and then I, I would like to, to, to do a comment about the numbers of this year. We have a big investment, it's the first year that we invest in a new web page and we suppose that it will cost between uh, 5,000, 6,000 6, euros, we don't know exactly. So that is the refund money from last previous uh, conference in Paris, bank interest, PayPal, people who pay by PayPal, and uh, different trips executive director. So we have last year 22,700 euros of incomes and 18,562 expenses. So we got a, a, a net profit of 4,000 euros, but we are an association not looking for profit, like Bernadette said. So, uh, you will see here now the projected budget for next year. 
if you agree or if you want to do a comment, please uh, don't hesitate. Organizations, we expect it, we expect to have around 4,000 euros, accredited institutes, individual members, professional members. We are growing very much on professional members. That's a very good uh, thing. And then certifications, slowly, accreditations also very slowly, and then we expect to have more or less that we, we had that year. Eh? 22,000. We'll have good surprise, but you know, we don't want to be too optimistic. Yeah, huh? yeah. Okay, on expensive, you could see that we will have uh, a new webmaster and so, and, and we will have uh, the, the big expense uh, of uh, our new web page. So 20,000 euros, and we expect to have a net profit about 2,000. So that is our situation. Uh, uh, Jaume, maybe uh, I think we forgot to, to write that uh, in the incomes, as you say, we give a loan to the association uh, organizing the conferences, but then the, the, if things are going well, they reform. Uh, yes, yes, but but they refound in the other fiscal year. Oh, it will be yeah, yeah. Yeah, they right. refound in twenty one. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's right. That's right. That's, right. Okay. That's why I put like that. Okay, okay. Yeah. So if you agree as uh, members and um, and associates, uh, you have uh, um, Ingrida can send you that numbers and you will get all together and. Any one of you would like to say something or asking? Yeah, if people have questions, <laughs> if you need to ask questions, because we need to vote on both the, the financial report and also the report of the president. I forgot, but we will do the votes uh, all together. No questions? Okay, so good, Sharma, thank you. Okay, so <clears throat> thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Shama. Thank you very much. Um, so I think we we should vote, do the votes for the the reports, the the report of the president and the financial financial report. Uh, the voting in uh, Zoom like this is a little bit complicated, um, except if. Uh, so what I will try to do, we, we will see if there is anybody against. Of course, only the, the members can vote. Um, so the question will be that we will see if there is someone against, and then it will be easier to see uh, who is for. So raise your hand if you are again against. I didn't see, I don't see any. And uh, if uh, there is any abstention, who wants to abstain? Okay, so uh, Ingrida, I have to say that I don't know how many people uh, are voting because we, if, we, if you are uh, a representative of an uh, organizational uh, member, you have five, um, five uh, votes and uh, and Ingrida can you can you precise please uh, yes uh, I'll calculate later but uh, uh, about 35 members we are and uh, yeah I think I'll count later but uh, if anybody is against or abstain abstain uh, you could uh, write it in the chat yeah so it would be easier okay Ingrida did you write the name of all the participants yes I did okay thank you Good. and I we should, we should also have the recording of this meeting okay okay so uh, also I can say uh, on zoom you have the option to say yes or no to specific things and yes, which can also be used. Anyway, the unanimity, so it's easy for now. 
Okay, but if, yeah, we can vote by chat. This is what we thought before. But if nobody is against, then uh, we should not uh, 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 waste time. Okay? So do we consider that, uh, yes, reaction, where are the reaction buttons? Milena, I don't know, what, what do you mean, Milena, by uh, reaction? It means button? by the next to her name, you will see a yes, which marks that oh, she okay, has. Okay, okay, yes. okay, okay, I see it, okay. Okay, so if people want to, oh, okay, okay, I see. So we can click, look, look. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I think uh, we 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 could. Uh, well, good. <laughs> yeah, professional members. You can vote. Organizational member, etc. Okay. So thank you, thank you. So um, now, um, how, do we start by uh, the 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 election and the pre the introduction of the new uh, uh, team? I think Pierre Luigi, it would be your time now to introduce uh, the 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 proposal to the General Assembly for the president, vice presidents, and your program. Your Yes, thank you, Bernadette. Was uh, an interesting and challenging time this year to our board. Uh, this was to me a, a very deep process to see if uh, I would uh, engage more and offer what I think could be better for Erotas from my point of view, or just uh, let, uh, let flow. In, the, in this year, I always was uh, a minority into the board. So it was different, it was challenging to me to decide what to do. Because from one side, I said that I would uh, and uh, offer something, a vision, that I have. I trust a lot in transpersonal. I think that we underestimate the power of our association, the power of each of us as transpersonal people. We are the future, I think, not we as person. Of course, we in this, we are the future. There is always the, 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 the ambush of the ego. Yes, of course, but I think that we should have a we should dare, dare more on uh, uh, what we think and what we are, because the, we are on the edge of a change. We know, we, we all know that we are uh, at the edge of the change. And uh, we, seems to me, we are, or we are afraid, or we don't trust enough in us, or we are, all of us, we are lost in our, personal activity and uh, uh, problems and uh, we don't do enough to me. I was in, in our board, sometime I was arrogant fighting because I, I, I felt the, the will to do, to change. And uh, I felt a, a sort of, of chain and chain it, no, to do think. And uh, so this proposal, most of all, is a proposal, is a vision, is the vision that comes from the eros, the eros of the, the fire to change, to change, not just, not just change because we have to change. Of course, we are in the flow, everything change uh, uh, without us, we know, but uh, be part of this change, surfing, the change and giving uh, what we can do. And uh, transpersonal to me, of course, is not only something that comes from inside and uh, a, 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 
seeking for uh, spirituality, but most of all is working together. Go from the as the we space, as Wilber say, you know, this we we space to me, transpersonal, and our association should be a we space where we, as we did in our board, uh, where we put our face and. Uh, even though this means to disagree, but uh, sacrifice our disagreements trying to, for the good, you know? And uh, so this is most of all, I would like you understand uh, the proposal like, like this. If we will be a group, if I will be president, I want that all of us and all the, the persons that are engaged on Eurotas are not here. Have the, the, the will and the awareness to work as a, a one person to be part of the change that we can do. For this, I think, if, if I don't go in detail of the proposal, you can read it. Uh, and maybe if you will have any question, I will answer. But uh, of course, as you see, this is a great project that uh, one life is not enough to do all we wrote there. Of course, but why not? Why not dream? Why not to, you know, to put the fire inside and try to do of course, we could do this only together. Not just me, not just the board. All together we should do, we could do this. And if you see, I started with the vision and with the epistemology. I think that one of the difference between the transpersonal and other spiritual ways, even different between transpersonal and shamanism is that transpersonal come on the stage in that time at the after the 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 the, the time of the knowledge we are on the time of awareness so we can take everything we can take the the, the ashe we say in brazilian in in, in portuguese the ashe is the force the sacred force of the shamanism we can take all the, 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 the uh, knowledge of the, uh, the rational vision. So the, the, the academy or the, or the, the psychology and the, the ancient tradition, and we can offer something more. We can offer a new framework. We can offer a new epistemology Epistemology means how you can say this. For example, I say, I am, uh, I feel that we are all one. Okay, which is your epistemology? So how you can, you can say this, that we all are one? And just for example, so I think that transpersonal should offer vision, epistemology, and methodology to do this, to, to help the development of the human being. This is something that only transpersonal, intending with transpersonal, a community of professional that has a background on also on, on rational way, because we can step, we, to go beyond, we have to step on the rational. We have to step on the knowledge and go beyond means transcend include, as we know, the, the, the rational into the intuitive, into the awareness, into the integral way. So episteme vision, epistemology, and, uh, and the methodology. So I would like to, to uh, suggest to organize all the methodology, to, to gather all the methodologies methodologies of uh, clinical methodologies and research methodology to create an archive for that. 
in, in, in the sense that when we go outside, we go outside with, with a strong background, with a strong strength that we say, we have this, this, and this, and we can offer to you. Bernadette spoke about politicism. We can offer to you politics a methodology, an epistemology to go beyond the myth, your myth, you are the best, America first, to go beyond America first. And we can explain to them that America first is a mythological thinking, lower than rational. And then there is psychic, casual, and non-dual. And after that is the integral. We have maps to do this. We have the capacity to work on state of consciousness and those state, states or uh, stages of thinking. This is something that I don't know any other association, any other professional that can give this. So, and then all the, the other thing, then, then the, all the, the, the possibility to work with, with uh, the youth, another, another important is bring the youth into, into because uh, we have to, of course, it is, it is clear the reason why we should bring young inside the board, actively working, and also global to, to motivate. You, you, you see, we are 47 from all around the world, and we feel like a family. And how many persons, you think how many persons like us are, that are not here, we can connect with. We are a lot of people, a lot of people, but not just numbers. We are friends, we are connected, not because uh, we are, uh, we have family link, but because we have uh, a soul link. We, we, all of us coming from different places of the world, from Korea, from Australia, from Canada, from Brazil, from Russia, from Italy, so, but we, we get this place. This is something, this is a miracle. And the vision that I would like to give, uh, to, to bring ahead, to run in the next year is to remember that this is a sacred place that this is a magic and we can act as if we remember any moment. So this is uh, what I want to say. If you have any question, here I am. Okay, maybe some people have questions. So I think Pierre Luigi, that you should uh, introduce uh, the team because you are presenting yourself as a team. Yeah, yes, it, you know, it is wrote, the two vice president could say something. Yes, it's wrote on, on the on the paper. As you know, I I I my idea was to create a strong uh, no, the, the the structure is a strong office of presidency with the president, with the two president, which be, would be Magda Soleil and Yuri Bichonsky, with the former president, Bernadette, and with the executive director. These five persons should run the association in everyday life to be in a fast track, we can say, to, to just to do things. To, to act what the board decides in a fast way. This should be a strong and, uh, uh, and uh, close working people. Then the board, and the board for now, we suggest to vote for the same board we had, more uh, uh, Lita, uh, because the idea is to, in these three years, to work uh, to add more young people, to co-opt more people into the board, to have half and half young and uh, elders. And also the idea is create this uh, advisor, uh, board of advisors, 
the reason why of the Board of Advisors. Here we see Ingo, we see Hans Peter from a lot of time. We don't see, we see Lindy, for example, and there are a lot of other people, I think, to, to Vitor, I think, to a lot of other people, to less. And person maybe that are engaged for three, six years, and then they finish to be on the board and disappear. Yeah, oh, Luigi, also, Luigi, you don't need a treasurer? <laughs> In your team? <laughs> In your team? <laughs> yes, it's not. No? No? If it's not, uh, I, I put, okay, it's, 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 a, it's a missing. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> yes, yes, of course. And of course, the secretary also. Of course, yes, yes. No, but actually, Sharma, there is no change for these uh, for these uh, people. Yeah. Okay. Yes, and yes. and the board, you know, this is uh, okay. Oh. Just finish with the board of advisors, and of yeah, course, yeah, yeah, yeah. we can add, we add we will add uh, Jaume, secretary. The board of advisors, because if you are if you have to engage such strongly to do something for Eurotas. And then in three years, we have to left to leave, or six years we have to leave, is personally from, because we also are person, should be a little challenging. If we know that all that we do, we can stay again to work with and to help shifting to the board of advisors, and uh, give continuity to the work we did, and giving advice, and giving uh, and doing work, uh, creating project, create content, because this board of advisors with gather all the old, the former board member that they should, they could stay if they want in this board of advisor, and. Uh, be this, this, this sort of think tank of Eurotas, the place where all the ideas grows, all the project uh, can, can be prepared and offered to the board. I see the board more as an executive board that do the things, that think, that decide and do the things. And the board of advisors, the place where we create, because to create, to write articles, to create uh, epistemology, to, 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 to connect, to collect uh, the methodology is a work. And this should be the work of the Board of Advisors. So I think that I finish. So is there anything you want to add, Magda and, and Yuri, that you, included in uh, the proposal that we sent to the members? Ah, to the members? Yes. Yes, I really want, I, would, I really want to, to before, uh, before I really want to, to say thank you to Bernadette for your work. Uh, I have to, to, <laughs> to say that when Bernadette said, oh, maybe I will, uh, that will finish, I said, oh, I will finish with you. <laughs> I, want, I, want, I won't remain in the, in the board without you. Thank you, Bernadette. Uh, fortunately, fortunately <laughs> you also you remain in the board. <laughs> uh, the, yes, that w maybe we, 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 we have not been uh, always uh, agree, but that's because we are different. <laughs> we are not the same person. But uh, it has been really, really a very, very good work which uh, you have been doing and which you have been mm, 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 helping to the team, or to the board to do. Uh, uh, I've been member of, of ECCA, of the certification committee for, for 10 years. And, and we have been creating several departments. I've been present in the, in the, in the, in the department of the, uh, uh, education, in the coaching, and we create the, the, the Eureka now, right now. We have now several members from Eureka, from the, 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 the department of the, the knowledge and indigenous, indigenous knowledge and anthropology. 
here we have uh, Stephen, we have uh, Alan Mulnex and, uh, uh, and Irene, we have uh, also Milena, we have Katy, we have uh, Marc Antoine, we have Vladimir, of course. We have uh, also people, well, Bernadette and Regina, thank you. We have also people in Latin America, we have uh, uh, people in, <clears throat> in, in, in Chile uh, and in Mexico, and we are really open to, to increase this, this team working for indigenous knowledge and, and anthropology. Uh, I want to say also as vice president that I really want to do many, many things and I really want to be engaged with the work of Bernadette because uh, I think you are really, really a good, a very good president uh, for me for the moment that is one. I hope with Pervici it will be a very good team also and we will work together and that thank you for your or for, for your presence and for to be listening to me. I think you want to say no. thank you to Bernadette thank you. also. Thank you, Bernadette, and, uh, and thank you very and much. all the team. All it the, has, it has been a real ple pleasure yeah. to be together all this time, mm -hmm. and we will follow to be together. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> I would like just to say something that if uh, uh, some people feel like becoming member of, or, of some departments like Eureka, yeah. it's yeah. possible, it is still possible. Yeah, 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 yes. Thank you, thank you. I, I, I try to say that, <laughs> yes. Of course, it's open, it's open, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. We had a, a meeting last, uh, in Paris, in last conference, and we, we, we decide, uh, we, we had some decisions and maybe we can, we can think in a new meeting, Zoom meeting in, in, in the next month for discussing new projects and, and, and new things. And of course it's open to anybody who wants to come. Okay, thank you. Okay. Yuri, would you like to okay, yeah. say something as yeah. president? So, uh, the Eurotas board is a very interesting and challenging place, okay, uh, with a lot of very interesting ups and downs. Um, I like the passion that people have, even when we agree or disagree, the passion and the commitment is always there. Uh, I want to thank you, Bernadette, personally, that you are not abandoning us and staying there, okay? Uh, for me, you were always some kind of a safety net. So, in moment of crisis, I was feeling you were holding my, our hands. So I'm looking for a fruitful cooperation for more projects, more expansion, more ideas. Just continue growing and never stop growing. As I always say to my students, when an apple becomes ripe on the tree, next stage it becomes rotten. So let's continue growing and not stop. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Um, so now it would be time uh, to vote for uh, the future. So, um, what we have to do is to, or you have to confirm and to agree uh, to our proposal of this pre uh, Pialuji as president, Magda and, and Yuri as vice president, and still about other people, uh, and Lita as a new board member. Um, is there anything else, Hans Peter? I don't know where if Hans Peter is still there. Anything else we have to do to be uh, official? I, I sent I sent already an email to Ingrida yeah. uh, with with what I need. I need only from six persons something from the president, vice president, secretary, vice secretary, and treasurer and vice treasurer. Only these six. It's enough. And okay. I need I need some some dates, some some um, which I sent to Ingrida. I will register online 
And if I need a signature from someone, I will ask you. I'm not quite sure. So it, I can do this already tomorrow and or the day after tomorrow. That's all I need. Okay. Okay. So, so the idea for our uh, life and not for only for the legal uh, uh, requirements from Austria. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so it means that for another three years until end of um, September in three years, the board is officially registered. Okay. We okay. don't have to, we don't need to do anything else. Okay. There's okay. just to be done this procedure every three years. That's all. Yeah. 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 This is the advantage of Austria. Austria. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's right. So what do we do? Do we do the same? If you agree, uh, you put a, 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 a some like that and uh but what else can you so now the question is uh is there any but we cannot say no we cannot say no we can say no there's a red spot the red no in red no we can say no by this and we can we can say yes by this and we can say no with the face with the tears. Ah, okay. No, the face okay. with the tears. Yeah. I don't see. I don't see. Yeah, it. yeah. The okay. face with the tears. Yeah. Oh. Now we can say no in the chat. Okay. It's easier. Yeah. Say no in the chat. So let's vote now. I think it would be important that we clarify no to what? No to the president, no to the vice president. I think we have all the votes. Actually, I think uh, it's possible to vote for them as a team because this is, you okay. know, how our process went on and, and they, they, we don't have, you know, a choice to okay. this one as a president. We, we came to an agreement and we proposed to the General Assembly to vote for the three. <laughs> okay, so um, if you disagree or abstain, uh, please uh, mention that in the in the chat. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. For people who are not already uh, officially member, uh, then you, the, you you don't have the possibility to vote, but. Uh, Okay. Okay. So, no, nobody against, which means normally that uh, there is one. There is one no. Ah, where? Well, I don't see. I did not see. In the it. chat. From Camelia, it's right. Yes, from Camelia. Okay. Ah, okay. Okay. Pardon. So, okay. More no. So if there is no more no, that means it will be, it will be yes. So congratulations, my friends. Abemus papam. Abemus papam, exactly. <laughs> okay, so um, thank you. And so now the, the, the best is, will be what happens, you know, in the next months uh, and years. And I think would, that would be nice now to give uh, the time which is left to people who joined us and want to say something about uh, themselves or their organizations or their countries or whatever. So uh, if, if you... If you want to, if you want to say something, please uh, raise your hand or say your name and start to talk. Okay. Hello. Gabby. Hello. Gabby, introduce yourself and your association, please. Okay. Um, this is Gabriel Fernandez from Barcelona. 
Um, I, I work in a, in a center which is called Cercle Transpersonal, and we are in the process of becoming an accredited, cent an accredited institute in the future. We have developed a three-year training program in transpersonal psychotherapy. Me personally, I graduated from CIS, California Institute of Integral Study. I completed a PhD in 2017 there, and I've been linked to the transpersonal community since 1996. That's why when I started as a practitioner, as in my personal quest, uh, looking for transpersonal connection. And uh, that's it. And I hope we'll meet in person as soon as we can, right? Because it's not the same as meeting this way. But still, it's been a very nice experience to start knowing the people I don't know from this association. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Welcome. Who? Hello, I'm Alan. I'm very happy to participate to this meeting and I feel very happy to, to be connected to all of you because I felt I feel a lot of beautiful energy, a lot of nice project and it's opened me to the world <laughs> and this is great to see people who are acting in their personal uh, ways and the personal ways and the spiritual ways and to put it in act and this is very important for me because uh, all the spirituality is useless is would be useless without this action uh, personally i've been uh, traveling in spiritual world since uh, 1982 since i was working with arnaud desjardins i don't know if uh, someone Yes, you know, Arne de Jardin, the master, master in dreams, um, and uh, his, his spiritual master was Swami Chikraj Nampak. And I did a lot of psychotherapy, etc. And 10 years ago, I decided to, to interior myself in, in the practice. And I, I, was on, I am on two ways, this, and these two ways are combinating. The first, uh, the first one was sophroanalysis. Sophroanalysis is uh, like transpersonal because it's mixing um, an approach of psychology, emotional, body, uh, uh, physical, and also spiritual and, and energetical. And so this, uh, this approach in, uh, invite tools from meditation, from, from dancing meditation, from, uh, tools from um, sophrology in an accompaniment of in psychotherapy. And in uh, six years ago, I became the director of a school called Institute of Sophro uh, European Institute of Analysis. This, uh, this institute uh, provide uh, training for, uh, for how do you say, teach new practitioners and master, master practitioners. This is the two years course. And in, in the meantime, I was uh, uh, trained in uh, shamanism. So I am also a shaman, but I don't introduce shamanism in sophroanalysis when I teach it, when I practice it, yes. But when I teach it, uh, I don't put, I would say, healing in, in the, um, the teaching. What is interesting also for, for me, uh, in, uh, when I can also co um, provide, uh, is the sensibility of sophroanalysis in transpersonal uh, uh, world. And also over, you know, over association and over uh, school coming from France, because we are two school, two main school in France for software analysis, and uh, and I can, you know, uh, talk about Eurotas uh, to the school, and I am a member of also of the bureau of the European Association of Software Analysis. And uh, this association could also, um, uh, how do you say, uh, 
implicated, uh, be implicated in, a, in Eurotas as well. So what I like here is to, to hear something that make a link between psychotherapy and, and spirituality and energetic, energetic approach that for me is, um, how to say, is the future of the way we can, how to say, help people to live in their real being. And I'm so very sensible uh, to uh, the aspect of spirituality in terms of taste, but without uh, spirit, spiritualization evasion, you know, but uh, within a spirituality, we could be really help us and help people to incarnate it, to incarnate really what we are in deep of their soul. And so all the energy here, all that I can hear, uh, um, make me think, make me feel gratitude to meet uh, Bernadette uh, two days ago. <laughs> so I'm happy to be involved in this, uh, in this um, meeting. And thank you very much for your welcoming. Thank you, Anna. Thank you. Some words from, I don't know, which part of the world? Brazil, South Korea, Canada? I say goodbye. See you soon, everybody. Bye, Magda. Anyone else would like to say something? Margot? Hello, say goodbye Thomas. to... Ah, Thomas, Thomas. Thomas. Bye-bye. Thomas? Yes, yes. Hello to everyone. Uh, my name is Tomas so from the Czech Republic. Um, I have met a few of you uh, in 2017 during the International Transpersonal Conference in Prague. So uh, I'm managing director of the International Transpersonal Center Holos in the Czech Republic in Opava. Um, we are still working on reconstruction of uh, our building, but uh, even or since 2010 or 11, uh, we work there for people in uh, spiritual emergencies or uh, in other types of crisis situations. Uh, currently, we have um, a team of uh, therapists who work there and um, so we are still slowly expanding and uh, 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 and uh, uh, I think uh, we are doing uh, nice things for for the people um, uh, currently, we work on uh, uh, transpersonal training uh, together with, uh, with Stan, the Rock Legacy Training, and uh, which we intend it to start uh, in uh, two weeks in October. But uh, unfortunately, due to the COVID situation, we had to postpone the start. So uh, we will start in March next year, hopefully. And um, I'm very happy to be there with, uh, with you and uh, to become part of, uh, of Eurotas. And uh, uh, I will do my best from my position to, uh, to make transpersonal psychology uh, better and to um to to get it uh, more accepted uh, in in general in the world and hopefully make a better world with you with you all so thank you and i'm happy to be there <laughs> thank, thank you yes. Yeah, for new new organizational member as uh, gabby and the uh, circle of Transpersonal Association in Barcelona. And so that's nice to welcome new association and from different countries, you know, this is how we can grow. Hi, everybody. Hi. Oops. Oops. 
Are there two of us? Hi. <laughs> you want to go? Okay. So uh, greetings from uh, Arizona. <laughs> so I, uh, I do have uh, the intention to uh, build something, you know, transpersonal in India where I live. Um, uh, th then what happened is I uh, got sidetracked uh, by, by meeting um, Jim Garrison at the last Eurotas convention and I'm now deeply involved in doing my PhD. So for now, I'm going to hold that as an intention for uh, the, the future that is definitely uh, something I'd like to uh, work on. And um, in the meantime, if, if anybody's doing projects like applying for the UN and all that, that kind of thing, I think I can be interested in and I'm, I think I can like fit that into my crazy crazy life right now and I think it would be something I would enjoy doing so uh, I don't know how if some if you want to put us in touch who, who are the people working on those kind of international applications and joining other you know groups and things like that good so, to see you all and and um, thank you Bernadette for your tireless and gracious service all these years i i know i sit in the background but i appreciate you know how much i appreciate you yeah we are close uh, hey, I could just forward briefly, to briefly address that margot also so bernadette and i uh, agreed that to to work further on the unesco and un application and i would be very happy to have you on board yeah, yeah? so i we, let's connect on on email further. so a good speaking uh, english speaker I don't view. I would like to say hello to you, and you say something, maybe, Bernadette. Do you agree? What? John Drew is here. Ah, John Drew. Where is John? Yeah. Oh. Hi, John. Could you say something? <clears throat> oh, John. Yeah. Welcome. Hi, John. <laughs> I've, I've, I've nothing really to say, except that as a former president of Eurotas, I'm delighted. Can you hear me? Yeah. Very yeah. well. I'm, as a former president of Eurotas, I'm really pleased to see what progress you've made. Bernadette, special thanks to you over these many years. You're looking younger than ever, I think. It's lovely. And um, I was talking to Monique, who was one of the founding members uh, uh, just uh, two days ago. She's in Greece. And uh, she also said to send on best wishes to everyone and mm -hmm. congratulations. That's all I have to say. But well done with what you're doing. Well done with the new work and, and well done with the new presidential views for the future. Very ambitious, I think, but I hope they'll work. Thank you. Thank you, John. Thank you, John. Maybe our friends from South Korea would like to say something. Okay. Yep. Yes, hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. Uh, uh, I am Myungwon from South Korea. Um, I'm so glad and so honored to introduce myself and my wife, Ari. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, uh, five years ago, I started to experience transpersonal breathwork from Dr. Ingo Yajes and Judith Miller. And um, since uh, three years ago, I introduced transpersonal breathwork uh, in, into Korea for the first time. And Korean people like it uh, very much. And uh, 18, 18 years ago, I found the Department of uh, Transpersonal Psychology in a uh, graduate school in Korea. So uh, this year, uh, uh, I am very glad uh, to be a member of uh, professional in Eurotas. And I am very grateful to uh, uh, all of the members of Eurotas and uh, Dr. Green uh, and uh, Ingrida. And especially, uh, I thank uh, very much to Ingo Benjamin Yajes uh, to, uh, uh, to introduce me to 
this Eurotas and new practice of transpersonal psychotherapy. And I hope uh, I am uh, I am uh, helpful uh, in the future to the Eurotas. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very much. Thank you. <laughs> Good. Yeah. I feel um, very grateful to you uh, for accepting me to this association. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. You're very welcome. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you, Thank you very much. People and new energy too. <laughs> Someone else? Pascal? Would you like to say something? Open the microphone. Okay. It's okay, this? Right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, hello, everyone. I'm um, a little impressed to, to meet, uh, meet you and uh, to see how the, our association, uh, my association with you now, uh, is so over the world. I'm sorry, my English is not so good. <laughs> and um, I think it's a uh, very, um, supportive to, to, to see how it's uh, extended and I hope it will go on. Uh, I come from Belgium. Uh, I've met uh, the psychotherapy uh, by the breath uh, with Marie-Françoise Louche, who is also a member of Eurotas. Who was there? And yeah. She's, I don't know where she is now. And uh, I work uh, like a psychotherapist and I'm so happy to to um, find my, my way um, with no need to, to disguise myself, to, to dare to, um, to express the, um, the part uh, who is um, so um, necessary. So, um, as Bernadette said, uh, we need it, but so difficult to express. Then uh, I'm so happy to, to find um, the transpersonal way to, to share this. Um, I work like a psychotherapist um, in Belgium, and uh, we just uh, this uh, spring found um, a school of breath with uh, Marie-Françoise Louche. Uh, who had uh, some um, delay with the COVID, but uh, we're gone. That's it. Maybe we will have a new organizational member in some months. Yes. With you, through you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you, Pascal. Thank you very much, Pascal. Welcome. Yeah. Uh, my name is uh, Pirate. So I am from Estonia. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, thank you. I, uh, last year I ended uh, your uh, transpersonal school in Estonia. So, and uh, now I am working for him. So I am mentor in his uh, school. And uh, also I can be coach for the other mentors. Uh, my background is uh, a master degree in uh, uh, youth work and uh, social equality and I work in academical university, uh, Tartu University, so I teach uh, youth workers and uh, I was keen to the experiential education before I found uh, this transpersonal approach and uh, I think we can do something more in this educational field. So I haven't found my PhD mentor or supervisor or topic yet. So I saw a lot of uh, interesting people here. So I am already keen to meet you in Estonia in this Eurotas conference uh, next year to know more about you. Thank you. Thank you, Pierre. Thank you. I think it's, a, it's, a, it's a, the right moment to say that uh, this Stalin conference, which should be right now, uh, is postponed to next year. And maybe we should give the, the, the dates. Uh, Yuri, do you know them? Or, uh, because we want to meet in person next year. Yes. 
in 2021. It will be from 22, September 22 to September 26. Yeah. And in can Mar I ask everybody with shamanic connections to, to tell the spirits to end this COVID thing, please? Yeah. And it will be a wonderful conference about education. And, and we yeah. really uh, look forward to, to, to meeting you there and to be able yeah. to, to really uh, connect physically. It's about, we, well, it's also about inner ecology. Inner ecology. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which actually is very important with uh, different, how we get infected with pandemics and how we can not be infected. Okay, so. Is there a last word for today? Um, yes. Yes. Can I say something? Cool. Sorry. Yes. Neta. 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 Hi. Neta. Hey. Oh, pleasure. From Israel. Israel. Uh, yes. So first I really want to say that I'm uh, really very moved. Huh? I feel much I really missed you because I haven't been to the conferences for the last few years. Yeah. Uh, and I wanted to thank you, Bernadette, for your warm heart and your uh, welcoming and your spirit. Uh, I always remember the speech that you gave and you said, it's important that we'll choose what we're fighting for and not fighting against. And I took these words with me. So thank you for that. Um, I've been in the transpersonal uh, movement for many years now. Uh, I'm the head of the transpersonal psychotherapy department in a college in Israel. Uh, actually, I don't know if it's thanks to the corona or thanks to the big mess that we have these days in Israel, but our department is just getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Well. Actually, this year we're going to start a four new classes with almost 70 new, uh, 70 new people, 70 new students. So it's very exciting and it's very nice. And it's also a lot of hard work. Uh, we also started a new program in one of the universities in Israel, in Haifa University, which started a master degree and then a PhD degree in uh, integrity of psychotherapy. So they study a lot about transpersonal and they do a lot of research. And it's really been very exciting times uh, in this aspect in Israel. Uh, and I really hope to, to see you all and hug you all next year. Uh, and enough with this Zooming already. <laughs> uh, some basic human touch for everyone. So thank you once again. Thank you, Neta. Thank I you, Neta. Yes. I think there was somebody else who wanted to say something. But I'm Maybe not. Marina from Moscow? I don't know. Yeah, hi to everyone. Hi to all. And I'm so glad to see you. And uh, at first, I want um, to express my grateful to Bernadette because you are so great women, <laughs> so great woman, and you're so sensitive and you're so strong. And um, most of all, uh, for your great work as a president and for last conference, of course, uh, of course. And <clears throat> I want. Uh, to share uh, wonderful news uh, from my uh, transpersonal work because last year we began uh, our res scientific research uh, of alternative state of consciousness with faculty of fundamental medicine of Moscow State University of uh, alternative state of consciousness and it is a very specific theme for this faculty but we um, got some interesting results and I hope that in future I can publish this result for everyone and um, I, I love this transpersonal field because this field have so great opportunities for human development 
that I want to be here in future. Thank you. Ah, we can't tell you. Okay. Marina. Marina. Okay. Okay, okay. Thank you. One more word. So if, I think I will give the last word to the new president of Eurotas. But before I will say thank you to all of you and all my love and support and I will continue and be with you for many years, I hope. So Pierluigi, please, could you, okay. First, could you close? Like, yes. First, I would like to thank all uh, the board for the patience and for the trust, for the fighting and for the, the achievements. And of course, you, Bernadette, was, uh, he was great. You know, I always was pushing uh, more yeah. and more, but uh, your style, uh, your way of being president was, was great for what, for the step we are and we were. So I am very happy you will, su will support uh, us for the next uh, step and will be with us and we will work together. Thanks for all of you. You are, for those are here and for those are not, I am sure we will do a great work. Expect from me and from all of us a, a sort of uh, uh, several invitations to, to work, to do, to do, to, to give, to, to, run projects together to engage because uh, this is uh, what we want to do. So thanks to all. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Ricci. <laughs> bye bye. Bye, thank you. To the next. See you next year. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you again. It was great to see you. Bye. No, man. Bye bye, Mula, Ari. Thank you. Bye bye. 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 Welcome, Lita. <laughs> bye bye, Ludmila. <laughs> bye bye, Jaume. Bye bye, 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 Hmm? Finish. Grida, congratulations. Has been a very good Zoom. Thank you. Thank you to all of you. Congratulations for organizing that event. And we <laughs> are in a very good moment in our association. Thank you, John. Good luck. Good luck. I can close now, eh? Yes, you can close. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>